ourselves together. Again. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. And that was no other than the brother Fela Kote and the Africa 70. The name of the song was Let's Start. And that was the live version of Blessed Start with no other than uh, the legendary Ginger Baker. Um, for those who don't know who that is, you got to step your game up. You got to step your game up. Um, and definitely, um, I definitely keep you intact what's going on. Um, I got to be playing a lot of uh, fail out music on the show. A lot of good music to definitely check out and listen to. Uh, as well um so i want to get into something real quick here on the show um coming up in a few i'm gonna have uh a great interview a real quick interview on the show tonight um but right now let me get into this real quick and i'll talk to you all in a second what is SUT? Simply United Together is a catalyst for positive social change and community empowerment. We support a diversified idealism that promotes community sustainability, human relations, and civic empowerment. SUT Global was founded in May 2011 by Dr. James Jones Sr., who is a native of Youngstown, Ohio. He is the founder and chairman of SUT Global which originated on Facebook. We are a grassroots international community service organization that has seen a phenomenal growth since its inception. Our headquarters are in Atlanta, Georgia. We currently have over 350 chapters, 52 divisions, and represented in 49 of the 50 states. Additionally, SUT is represented internationally in 44 countries, such as Africa, Mexico, Canada, Europe, Middle East, Asia, South America, Australia, and the Caribbean. 
With its consistent growth of members and an eye on even broader horizons, SUT Global wants to take its mission plus message to the next level. These entities will allow the members to interact with each other on a more personal level while giving back to our local communities across the world. SUT recently won the Steve Harvey Neighborhood Award for Best Community Leader and other numerous community outreach awards in 2015. Dr. Jones also helped create the newly united platform of Community Compilation, a group of organizations across the country coming together, serving a huge purpose as one. Our founder and chairman, Dr. James Jones Sr. believes that being a blessing to someone else is the most important thing that a human being can do. Different people, same purpose, Simply United. With the over 50 initiatives that Simply United together has, it's very easy for you to get in where you fit in and make a difference today. Yes, 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 and that's a little bit what we do here at Simply United together and Simply United right here on Simply United Radio. So look, y'all, we're going to get right into some news that you can use right here on the Man Cave Show. Um, let's get into it, y'all. Are you not in the- Your attention, please. This is an important announcement. So what I so I won't forget this week because I forgot last week. Um well I didn't forget, I just did it late. Um but I'm gonna get into um I'm gonna get into my uh coon of the week. Um and and I'm gonna t- I'm gonna share the story uh first. So um my nominee and my award recipient for the coon of the week this week is going to be um no other than and uh, <clears throat> I'm sorry no other than Washington Redskins uh Lyndon um actually not him but actually it's going to be Miami Dolphins uh Maserati Rick um that's his uh Instagram name and name so look Here's the story, so y'all can understand. So, Washington Redskins, Lyndon Antonio Trail, asked his followers, why do black athletes marry white women? So, he posted a picture with, um, of course, seems to be one of the persuasions on the um, on the photo, which is nothing wrong with that. Please don't get me wrong, but um, this is the thing that goes on. This is what what he brought this up for being a black athlete and why do they just happen to find and stumble upon and marry um white women um seems to be a preference so the brother um um the brother responded um Maserati Rick responded and said the answer is simple brother most of the sisters were raised in broken homes and they don't have proper guidance to how they should treat a man. So they mess up a lot in relationships. The biggest difference is a white woman knows her position and accepts her role as a woman and let her man lead. Black women believes it's 50-50 and you have to be uneducated to ever think such a thing. Black women are stubborn, closed-minded, and always want to argue and be the boss. Men don't like that ish. Especially if you're a successful young black athlete, uh, looking for a woman to submit to do their part and they handle businesses men need peace of mind and you don't get that with black women <laughs> the brother goes on and says let's just leave it at as it is the biggest problem with some women is that they can never take responsibilities for their actions they hate to admit when they're wrong and you can never get better at anything unless you admit your fears and mistakes how would i be a better football player if i'm not coachable Black women are not coachable. Let's put it in that perspective. 
Then he also went on and said, man, I'm tired of them. You got to go through ish um, to know your to know medications. The best thing I could have done was get me a white girl and great family to support her in our relationship. And so with that conversation and on social media from the conversation between Lyndon Antonio Trail and Maserati Rick, um, I'm going to have to let them both share the Coon of the Week um, award uh, right here um, here on the Man Cave Show. They are going to be the Coon of the Week. I got a call already, though. Let's see what's going on with this caller right here on the Man Cave Show. Hold on, y'all. You're calling the Man Cave Show, Simply United Radio. Who's this? Hello. Yo, did you call the Man Cave Show? Who's this? Hey, this is Cody Wright from all I'm Wildcats, Phone Guard, and I'm called Six. Cody, what's up, man? What's up, brother? What's what? going on? What's going on, man? Just want to give a shout out by my all out of Wildcats. It's a good organization. Been in-